it's Uncharted here. I'm talking about a little bit of a tech option that I've heard come to my attention that when Janema does his auto combo, we can apparently counter him because we have at least five frames to work with. Now, the problem with that is I can see this blowing up two different ways. One, again, no assist. We're not even doing the assist mix-up, because even that gets blown up to hell. How do you fight that? That looks identical. So if he teleports over you, and you think, oh, he's doing auto combo, and then he just does... Sorry, I'm not Janemba. And he just does this. How do you... Visually, how do you tell? And he can easily bait you. And worse yet... Give me another try on that one. Let me find the timing to punish. I... I haven't practiced number combos, I don't care, but you get the point. Is that... He can just 2M us out of that if you rely on this. Then when we look at the actual assist version, I'm going to call assist about plinking after the light. Okay, that's how it worked. Okay, now that's just working, so... If he just goes for that, okay, let's see. That's weird. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's very reliable, depending on when they call. And I had it earlier. Yeah. That can end up just going really bad in your that Just really bad out of your favor. And you know, Jinnamas know how to finish their combos. I, it's not my hands, I don't care. I don't play this character. But while it seems tempting to be able to just go like for this, there's too many ways that it can just go wrong. And also if you just talk about just raw mix-up options, you don't want to play his game. Because when he just... Also, um, I want to point out reflecting is also a danger because of the exact same reasons. Because he can do the exact same thing I just showed you. Let's set this to reflect. Oops, I'm Vegeta. Just easy punish you with like DR or 2M, whichever your choice is. Uh, if you try to call an assist during, um, like I'm gonna try and see if I can call Go Tanks to back me up. I don't know if I can get away with this, but I'll try. So let's set the dummy to do this. And then maybe a delay to him. Something like that. Let's just have him do that. Right. So let's bring in the boy. And let's have him do it to us. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I got crossed up. Oh my god, I'm just getting bopped. Let's try this again. Ha! 
Oh, interesting. Okay. So, we can just jump out of this pressure. This might be the best possible answer. Okay, let's do this. Oh, look! It's not real! <laughs> Janemba sucks! Alright, so instead of doing this option or trying to, like, double up on this, we, we will test this just for the sake of science. Oh my god, we could just jab it. Um, let's see what happens if he goes for his auto combo itself. I just got hit. Okay. So I didn't time that correctly. Let's see if I can jump. Yep. Let's try it again. Yeah. So let's jump. If you have the five frames to do your counter, you have the four frames to jump. So, if he's not forcing that on us, on you with assist, then you can just jump out. If he's doing it with assist, there are timings where it works, or timings where it completely screws up. Just hold it, because it's not a hard mix to react to. But if you feel like just proving him wrong, say. Can you handle this? Maybe he stops if he sees you counter once. It's an option if you have the hard read that he's just going for the auto combo. Uh, you can always just reflect during the actual mix-up and then jump out. Um, they could make it really true by using Yamcha assist perfectly timed, but in this case, I would literally just, when he does this to you, just reflect. Or jump. You're fine. 